Local health experts say Oklahoma has one of the worst overdose death rates in America. Today is International Overdose Awareness Day, and our Corley Peel talks with an Oklahoma woman who's made it her life's mission to draw attention to what's become an epidemic here in Tulsa County. Health officials say Tulsa County has the most overdose deaths in the state. We talked to one person today who tells us how prescription drug abuse affected her family. Six years ago, Michelle Evans lost her brother after he overdosed on Oxycontin. He uh, broke his leg in a soccer injury in high school, and he just had so many surgeries on and off, and it just eventually led to addiction. Evans believes his death could have been prevented. He was definitely overprescribed, and um, it just was it was a devastating thing to watch. In 2015, 164 people in Tulsa County died from overdose. Health officials say 60% of those drugs were from prescription drugs. They say it's easy to get the dangerously addictive narcotics. Take a painkiller once, oh, you feel a little better, then eventually you build a tolerance to it, and then you take a little more and you're accidentally addicted, which can lead to accidental overdose as well. They say first responders now use naloxone nasal spray to reverse the effects of overdose. The state is also using a drug database logging every time someone is prescribed drugs. We encourage doctors to use the PMP, Prescription Monitoring Program. They can check that and that will help eliminate those drug seekers. Since becoming Mrs. America 2015, Evans is making it her mission to educate others about the overdose epidemic and to help save other families from losing their loved ones. If people look at this addiction and prescription drug abuse uh, for what it is, a disease, um, and you know, make further steps with prescribing uh, better, then we can definitely help to improve the epidemic going on. To find out more information about overdose education and prevention, you can go to our website at kjrh.com. Reporting in Tulsa, Curly Peel, Two Works For You.